Hello. Welcome to my channel, Wild Buffalo Divine. I'm Mags. Thank you for stopping by. Today, we are going to do a general love reading. Look at your person. Now, I do not know which sign we're going to be doing today. So I've got my zodiac signs in my bowl here. They're all on pieces of paper. I've already done, I believe, six, maybe seven. So I don't even know who we're going to read for. That's the fun part. Let's go ahead and draw. Who do we have? <clears throat> Who's up next? Here we go. If you're interested in a private reading, all the information is below. Oh. All right, Pisces, you're up, my dear. Let's roll. I have prayed, meditated, saged, and cleared my energy. I've got four decks here. We're going to do, do two decks per person. As always, I ask that you re uh, remove all bias from this reading on my end. I want you to get a real clear, concise look at your person. Let's go ahead. Let's get it started. Pisces, what's your person's energy towards you currently? Coming in. Energy for Pisces. Person. Pisces person, please. There it is. Page of Swords. Whoa. Very curious energy. Tell me more. Pisces person's energy towards Pisces, please. That actually just bent my card. We got the death. Could be dealing with a potential Scorpio. I literally just bent my card. Oh, that's not a coincidence. <clears throat> I'm going to tell you right now, Pisces, I don't know who this person is. They're a shapeshifter. Very interesting that both of these characters, I don't know if you can see that. God, I hope the light picks it up. I'm really big on interpretive reads from the artwork. These two have the same exact color of sweater on. It's kind of creepy. Whoever you're dealing with, Pisces, major transformation. They've just come out of it. They've just come out of it. Tell me more, Pisces, person's energy. Spiritual journey. What? I can't make it up. Here, font. This person really wants to do right by you. They may have a passion for, um, <clears throat> yeah, two of coins. I get the strong feeling that this person is involved in some type of group, community, outreach program, meetings, and they talk about their transformation to others. I don't know where that's coming from, but again, I feel like this person's marked. Mm-hmm. And again, they're very curious about you, Pisces. They're looking at you like, who is this? Okay. Interesting. Bottom of the deck, four of wands. Whoa. Whoa. Talk about heavy partnership. A lot of admiration here. Very beautiful energy. Very. Okay. I'm loving it already. Let's go, Pisces. What's your energy towards this person? Huh? Right out the gate, King of Cups. There you are. Feeling very loving, receptive to this person. You love how curious they are about you. I just heard, feels good. <gasps> what song is that from? Feels good. Oh, God. I don't think, I, I don't know any of the lyrics. I'm just hearing that part specifically from that song. Feels good. Tell me Pisces energy towards this person too many. Pisces energy towards their person. Nine of Cups. Tower. Damn. <clears throat> Holy shit, Pisces. Not a single sign has gotten this card yet. This is a fountain. I will read this to you. This is your current energy. Hell yes. 
Okay, boom. I'm going to tap it. This is like me fist pumping you with the fountain card. All right. Hell yeah. Do you know why? Because you just came out of a major awakening. Knight of Cups. You're ready to bring love towards someone. Whoever this person is, you are ready. And this is beyond divinely guided. No doubt in my mind. No doubt in the cards. No doubt in my mind. The energy I'm feeling. I'm telling you right now, this person was sent to you, Pisces person's favorite color or car could even be red there it is pisces i got you fam i got you i got you two of cups there's your energy can't make it fuck it up judgment you made the judgment call this is your person boom i'm gonna read this fountain card god do i even have my book up here hold on maybe i'm not oh i do i do okay i wasn't sure if it was in my desk or not here we go okay I want to read this to you, Pisces. This is huge. This card is not in any other deck. This is the Fountain Tarot deck, okay? This card is almost like a phenomenon, okay? So let me read it to you. Also, check out the infinity sign at the top, okay? Here's what we got. The fountain exists outside and beyond the cycles of birth, death, time, and form. It is the nameless, changeless source of which everything is a part it is the waking from the dream of separateness and identity and the recognition of oneself as not only connected to all things, but all things divine nature. When the fountain appears in your reading, relinquish all illusion of control and remain quiet. It invites you to observe, master less, and just be effortless, effortless and indistinguishable from life. You are the voice and the breath of the universe. This meaning is one of oneness, a moment of cosmic clarity, fully awake, the end of seeking, enlightened, surrender to that which you are, whole and perfect. Okay. Mm. Happy for you, Pisces. Pisces, I'm going to say it right now. I'm getting chills all over my body. Oh my God, my hand feels like it's got 20 pounds of weight in it right now, holding this just like this. Pisces, this is the first time you've ever felt this. Oh, I want to cry. Mm. <sighs> Let's take a peek at your person's feelings, please. What are your person's feelings for you? <laughs> five of wands and temperance. We've got five of wands clarifying the page of swords, temperance clarifying death, nine of wands. Um, <clears throat> this person has a lot of uh obstacles they have overcome this person's a natural alchemist this I, the fact that damn yep there it is the temperance card is all about balancing now what you may or may not realize is the water's going from the bottom to the top okay this is true alchemization this is someone who's about peace healing Coming after death. This is what fell underneath the death card. Remember how I said your person went through a massive transformation? You are their equalizer almost. It's like you help. This is a really specific message. Wow. I just heard Technicolor Dreamcoat. Whoa. No clue where that came from. I've even... Joseph and the Technicolor Dreamcoat. I haven't even seen that, heard that, anything in years. Here's where I'm, what I'm getting, though. You notice how normally a skull, like an animal skull, whatever, would just be bleached white. You can bleach it white. This one has colors all over it, all the way down the neck and the spine, okay? This person has lived, and you're the perfect person to understand that. They want you to know that. They see you for that. <clears throat> They also see you as being a competitive person. They feel there may even be competition for your heart. 
it is stressing them out slightly, but again, they're very good at overcoming obstacle after obstacle. This person also could really be saving money. Um, this person is being very calculated with their decision and their curiosity with you. It's like the curiosity feeds the calculations and the calculations feed the curiosity. Wow, that's a really <clears throat> ebbs and flows I've never really said out loud before. Uh, bottom of the deck, Knight of Cups. Look at this, Pisces. Two Knight of Cups, double confirmation. You both want to give each other love, okay? Straight up. This is really sweet. Very sweet and loving energy. Very sweet. Um, <clears throat> this person also may wear beaded bracelets, beaded necklaces, have beads hanging from the mirror in their car, have a beaded seat cover, like old school. I don't know where I'm getting, there's something about beads, a beaded curtain in their place. They give you a beaded bracelet. There's something about beads. I don't know what that's about. <clears throat> Juju beads? I don't know. I don't know. There's something about beads here. Okay, tell me about Pisces feelings, please. What are Pisces feelings for this person? Cross watchers, listen up, because I know you'd be watching. Pisces feelings for this person. Pisces current feelings for this person, please. Whoa. Now, I'm not going to take that because that's way too many. But you got a lot to say, Pisces. Tell me more. There we go. <laughs> oh, it's happening. Ten of Cups. You see that happy family? Ten of Cups. There you go. Tell me more. Do we even need more? Do we really do we really need more? <clears throat> Page of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles. Knight of Swords, clarity, communication. You cannot get enough of talking to this person. I feel like you and this person have hours and hours and hours of conversation. Can't make it up, King of Swords on the bottom. That's the king of communication right there, okay? Mm, can't make it up, jeez. All right, Pisces. Five of Pentacles fell under the tower. So I'll put it to you this way. I'm going to say the energy I'm picking up here, something happened. <clears throat> that made you feel left out, but I feel like it was just a, a bad day or something because all the other energy that I've got here is super positive. So this may have been something internally that you were going through, or maybe there was a moment where you were like, someone's going to get left out. I got to cut someone out. I'm getting cut out. Something, there's something about, I'm literally seeing a knife slicing through butter. Like that's so fucking random, but there's something about that. Someone was getting cut out. You got cut out, left out. You felt left out. I don't know what that is. You'll know if you're resonating with this, you'll know what that means. But then the, the fountain energy came in. So it was absolutely divinely guided because then we got the, the page of swords and then we got the nine of pence. Okay. You are very curious about this person as well. Okay. Clearly. You both have page of swords in your energies. This is in their energy towards you. And this is in your feelings towards them. You're curious. What exactly are their feelings? Maybe they're strategically only giving you bits and pieces on purpose. Either way, this is how you see them. Someone who has their shit together. Someone who's well-respected. Again, more red. I get like this person wears a lot of red. Or yellow. 
<clears throat> I also want to say this person is um, I just heard exotic gift giver like weird gifts like weird gifts that only you would appreciate that's so specific I don't even know <laughs> um, or they're gonna give you a really weird gift or they have a weird gift for you. I don't know, separate message. Or you got a weird gift for them. Maybe not, I don't know. This is why you want them. They know who they are. Hey, there's no secrets with this person. This person knows exactly who they are, where they're going. They're integrity filled, okay? All right, I think that's what I've got for you. We're at 15 minutes. I gotta wrap it up here, Pisces. Thank you so much. This was a gorgeous reading. I am so happy for you. I have not choked up and almost cried on anybody at all on these readings. So um, whatever you got going on, Pisces, you've clearly earned it. The universe has heard it. Your karma is coming in. In the meantime, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you want a private reading, all the information is below. It's a very intimate process. I've got repeat clients. They keep journals of our readings. It is the most beautiful thing I've honestly ever been a part of. I cannot tell you. Uh, I am just as much a, a part of what's going on in the collective as you are, Pisces. Believe that shit, okay? So, oh, look at that extra ring just for you. On that note, if this is where we part ways, my friend, all my love, stay strong, stay focused. And I will see you later. I'm going to bring uh, some more readings coming soon. We'll talk to you later. Bye.